Oh yeah, episode 8 of Minecraft Amplified coming at you. And in the last video I went over a lot of things and I didn't really concentrate too much on the gameplay, so this time, and I'm, I'm jotting down the coordinates here, let's say I'm negative 20, 80. And that's at Y85. That's kind of important too. Okay. Yeah, I, I I I focused on a lot of the updates and news, which you're going to be getting as I get the website uh, more, uh, you know, correct, and and it actually functions and looks like a website because all it is is a chat box right now in a white background. It's very 1990s, or early 2000s. So you're going to just get your news and information from there. I'm not going to say too much about what's going on after the website starts to catch on. And, uh, you know, enjoy it. Because, like I said, I'm trying again. And it's not just out of necessity. I've been wanting to do this for a long time. But uh, the fact that I really have to, like, focus on it now just, just makes it all that much more urgent. And I hope you guys understand, and I hope you can help me out. And remember, like I always say, just by watching my videos, you you are helping. But you can also help by liking, sharing, subscribing, and, and you know, all that, that that networking stuff because that that really helps me out too and it helps you out because it allows me to produce this content uh, more readily knowing that I have you know I guess you could say a future in this but I'm really just doing it you know to entertain that's all I want to do it for um, but you know if I can make a living off of it or supplement myself for a while hold me over until something comes along then uh, at least I'll have that but I just want to entertain you guys I want to do these videos and have fun with it and that's what I'm going to do right now right now we are well right now I am collecting glowstone because you know an epic bridge is not quite epic enough without some lighting that looks very sassy oh and I don't think I'm gonna do a big collection of uh, of netherrack right now I'm gonna save that for uh, when I actually need a bunch of it and then that'll also help me get levels even though like I was thinking about this before and anything past level 30 is not really practical because you know it takes as much much experience to get to level 40 as it does to get to level 30 you know it's really not your the most practical if you want to keep collecting past 30 it's really not practical or, or wise by any means so it's good to, to collect up to, until you get to level 30 and then spend it, you know, and try to get a, a fully powered tool of some kind and then, uh, you know, go again. Oh, hey, there's another guest. I wonder if I can hit him from here. It's my two, well, I got two arrows and that's how many it takes to kill them. So I don't know if I want to chance it. But I also, I'm, I'm, lo I'm noticing that uh, I don't have... A lot of choice going this way. Oh crap! Oh, that was that could have been bad. Ooh, that one gave me tingles. Okay, that I'll, that I'll do. That I can jump. Ooh, ooh. Uh, 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 uh. Never mind. I thought that was. I thought that was a uh, fortress, but it was just the blackness of the mis mismatched chunk loading. I don't know. See, that's what DRM does, man. You got to be connected to the internet. My internet is slow, therefore the map gen doesn't work quite right. <gasps> oh well. So this episode is probably going to be exploring the nether and trying to find another fortress. And I'll pick up this nether quartz as I go along. I know a couple of uses for this stuff, but I really don't see... <coughs> Whew. I really don't see how it, how it benefits you, like, in a big way. I know you use it to make beacons, which is beneficial because you can make areas of protection and safe zones and stuff like that. And and it's, it's that's a pretty cool feature plus I came up with the beacon idea like ages ago um, and then they finally put them in hello <laughs> batter up oh I missed see I'm I'm uh, a lot. oh my goodness Woo. batter up <laughs> oh this gas is so dead whoa okay that was no good he hit me in the face man I got hit in the face! Bring it! Oh, you are so lucky. Stop moving! I am going to destroy you. Batter up! Ha 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 ha. Come on, Gast. You're done. You are so done. You know why? 
Boom, shakalaka, woo, pow. Oh, that just missed. All right, I'm gonna get him. Whoa, you're not gonna get me that easily. Okay, now he's just messing with me. Come on, bring it over here so I can get you. Come on, guest. Oh, crap. That's it, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. Yes! Oh, I just missed him. Come on, give me another one. Throw me one of them fireballs. That's it, that's it, that's it. Get him, 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 get him. No! Oh, are you kidding me? It was right there. Man, this is so dangerous. I feel like I'm fighting a boss. Oh, that's it. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. What are you doing, Gast? I am going to destroy you. This is an epic battle. Yeah, that's it. Come to Papa. Come to Papa. Come to Papa. You know you want to. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Pow! <laughs> I am the master. Woo hoo 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 hoo. <laughs> now, wasn't that exciting? Oh, and I, and I lived too. That was amazing. Oh, crap! It's a magma cube! See, I, I beat the, the gas and I get killed by one of these guys, right? Oh, crap! He's huge. Oh! I'm gonna get him, though. But if there's a magma cube, that means there should be a, uh, 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 well, I guess it doesn't have to be that there's a, uh, another fortress nearby. Does there? I don't remember if magma cubes only spawn in near those or if they can spawn anywhere. And I've only ever only seen them in nether fortresses. Uh, well, I'm just gonna keep investigating because I wrote down my coordinates of the spawn point. Oh, jeez, not again. Oh, crap. Well, I better be careful because... Oh! Okay, eat something, you idiot. Get in the hole here. I guess maybe I am going this way. <laughs> uh. It's ridiculous! Yeah, I also, uh... Yeah, this... Ooh, should I go again? Should I try it again? I'm out of arrows, so I have to hit him with the with the sword. But I think he's stuck over there like the last one. So I think I can... Come on, guess. You want some of this? You want some of what Daddy's got? <laughs> oh, no. He's got a ceiling. He'll never come down. I just gotta run away. Is there a fortress this way? I know I wanted to check the other way, but I have to get away, away from this ghast, you know. Oh, soul sand. Whoa, that was a close one. Watch where you're shooting that thing, ghastly. Okay. Okay, this is not not good. Um, aha! I think I see another fortress. It's on the other side of this extremely dangerous lava lake. <laughs> Uh, is that, is that another fortress? Ah, uh, yes it is! Well, a single pillar of it, so hopefully there's more than just that. Because, oh my goodness, it is a good idea that I get some nether wart. And we need the blaze rods, mainly. But, uh, yeah, there's another fortress over there, so, uh... So, yeah, now there's two ways about going about doing this. I can go hard mode and try to get over to that island of, of, uh, netherrack. Uh... I got plenty of stone here, so I can I can build bridges. But uh, the other way that I am thinking about that might be a little smarter and safer is going around this way and seeing if it if there's a connecting platform. Uh, but for some reason, I don't think there is. I think I'm gonna have to go hard mode, or just you know, well maybe it'll maybe maybe oh 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 ah, eh, oh well that's a little better. Uh, but yeah, there is, that's the fortress right over there. So, we're going to have to look around and see if I can get... It might, I'm, I'm thinking it might extend this way, and it does. That's sweet. There's more of the fortress that way. But uh, it looks as though, no matter which way I go, I've got to cross this void of lava. Go figure. So, uh, so be it. The idea now, after I collect this, wow, you actually get a, these, these veins of, of quartz are like the really, really old veins of iron that you used to find in like the early days of in, in Infdev, when back when it was Infdev. <laughs> okay, I see, I see my access point here. I can get in right here. This is the most safest way across and get up there 
And we'll be good to go! Oh, yeah. And I'm not too far from... I'm only 100 blocks from my my spawner, so that's not too bad. Usually you have to travel like around 300. Screw that quartz. Um, that's not happening. And now I gotta be dangerous and precariously team off the edge of this platform. And, uh, you know, we're just gonna kinda build up here. Cause I'm on, like, on the base layer of this thing. And that's not good. I'm trying to get over to that platform. Very carefully. Very carefully. I don't want to cause a ruckus. And there I go again with this strange accent. Oh, you know what I'm gonna have to do, it looks like. I'm gonna have to get up inside that hole over there because this is this is blocked off. It's like there's another layer above the roof of this place that I've gotta get up. And God help me if there's a uh, gas around here right now because this is the most dangerous part! Oh, good, I made it. Whoo, okay. So, the next, th yeah, this is like all up in there. Like, how the heck do they expect you? I'll tell you what I sh well, I guess I could try, uh... That looks like the end of it right here. So maybe... <sighs> Alright. I'll, I'll try this. Try to get up there. Somehow, that's not so, like, ridiculous. <laughs> Let's see here. Hello, zombie pig. Hello, goodbye. I'm just passing through. Don't mind me, too. Yeah, it seems like I'm gonna have to go up there. I'm going to have to noob tube. Choo choo. Here we go. Noob tubing. It's the best way I know how, man. Okay, we're out of that stack of stone. How are we doing here? Uh, okay, I see what's going on. I see what the dealio. I'm gonna have to tunnel my way through up there. Now, this this is kind of dangerous, kind of dangerous because I don't have uh, any frame of reference for what is up there because there could be lava pools and lakes and such and things in that direction as well. So, uh, I, I think, oh, hello. Okay, maybe this is a better option because then I don't have to dig up directly. And I'm collecting nether brick that is pre-melted. So that's a good thing. Hopefully I don't stumble upon a, a, a blaze spawner right away. Okay, here's how we do this. Aha! I have gained access to the inside. Now I have to be careful because I could run into a wither. And those are not pleasant. Okay. Okay, sweet. So this is my entry point. I'm going to mark that off. Even though, like I said, I have... Uh, my coordinates already Okay, let's eat some bread As the gas continue to cry in the distance what do We have here. Okay, that's some kind of naturally occurring. Oh my naturally occurring pit And I'm just gonna keep going Because the lighting isn't too bad here gotta get my sword out though because you just never know when you're gonna run into one of those withers I mean, they're not the most dangerous mob in the game, but uh, not not fun to cr encounter. Okay, so that's dead end, and that's dead end, and this is a staircase up to what would probably be a dead end. I'm thinking so. No, no, it's not. Or is it? Is it? Is it not? Well, it's a dead end, but it ran into some quartz here. So while I'm here, yeah, it, it, I also noticed too. Now that I'm thinking about it, it doesn't look like the Nether has a lot of, you know, correlation with the Amplified. It doesn't seem like it's changed much because when the Nether first came out, it looked like ten times as heinous. Even if there wasn't any lava pools, like just navigating the Nether has always been dangerous. Because it, or dangerous, as I like to say. Because of the, just the sheer, unbelievably skewed and wayward nature of the generation of the map. So, you know, that's what that's all about. So like I do in some of my, my previous cave adventures, if I explored an area and uh, there is nothing going on, I simply walled it off. That's how I know never to go back there again. So let's try... Uh, oh! Aha! Blaze rods! Whoa! Did you see that? As soon as he fired the shot, 
I dodged. I got the block right in the way. Woo! Okay, so this is uh, pretty straightforward. You've seen me do this before. We get the guys, the, the, the blazes, to try to drop down in here like so. <coughs> and then we destroy them. Whoa! So, in the next video, I will try to pick up a couple of blaze rods. So we have those, and I'll try to find some nether wart, and then we can get the F out of here. So I will see you then. Stay awesome. And, uh, you know, check out the website and all that good stuff. And uh, have, I hope you had a great new year, and I'll see you later. Oh, yeah! Blaze Rod! Yeah!